Your iFly GPS can be updated several different ways. You can use a USB stick method from the iFly GPS website. You can also update using iFly Connect from our website on a Windows PC. Finally, you can update it using the Wi-Fi method on the iFly 720 and iFly 740. This is how we'll demonstrate an update in this video. First, assuming we've got the internet connection established and our Wi-Fi is on, we simply want to touch the update button. Here, you'll notice it says it's connecting to the server and since this device is set up as a beta user, we can choose beta or the production. We'll touch production and it should populate us a list. We'll see where it says connecting to the server and downloading the manifest. And now it's comparing. Next you'll see this list populate with all of the sectionals, weather, aviation database. If there's a software update, you'll notice that's in there as well. We can select or deselect all of these by tapping the button down at the bottom and then removing all of those check boxes. In this case, we're just going to touch one selection, which is the weather and TFR. We also have a fast weather and TFR, which would have done the same thing. But for the sake of time on an update, we'll just update the weather and TFR tap the install selected item. Now you'll see the next page gives you two progress bars. The top line is the actual file it's downloading. The bottom is the overall progress. In this case, they'll both be the same. You'll see a separation in these when you're looking at downloading multiple files, but it's good to be able to tell the overall progress. Once the update is complete, you'll actually see a window pop up and says update complete. Once that happens, we'll touch the OK button. And we should see it here any second. Here's the update complete. We'll tap OK. Now at this point, we're fully updated and we can go back into the iFly GPS software. 